don't be super awful. Keep your clothes on, don't be super awful. Those are the two rules. Talking, talking with famous people. Well, I agree, don't get all Nick, but he certainly is welcome. He, he, in no sense is he remotely restricted, in, in my mind. Like, he's he's not persona non gratis. He's just another freaking ENTP pulling ENTP bullshit, fucking up, feeling regretful, wishing he hadn't done that, trying to sort of talk his way back into everybody's good graces, you know. But... It doesn't work with me, obviously, because I've I've already done all that stuff, and I know all those those things that he's doing. So, you know, he's cool with me. That that's the thing. That's the hardest part for the NHP, in this case, Nick, to get through his head. Nick, you really are cool with me. I don't know about anybody else or whatever, but there are some people in the world who are going to be like. I don't give a fuck. And I'm one of those people. He's an inch who was trying to show off and it didn't work. It backfired. You know? I know exactly what it is. Whatever. He's not even a dick. He's trying to show off and it's not working. And it's upsetting him because he, he knows he's doing it. And he doesn't really... He doesn't really know how to go like... Oh, I'm fucking trying to show off, and I'm it's coming off fucking stupid, and I'm coming off like a fucking idiot. God damn it! He needs to just have that conversation with himself a little bit more. But he already is having it. It's like it's not like he's unaware. I get it. He's displaying his his growth pains here, you know. And uh, one of the other one of the millions of millions of mottos of black faith people is. We don't shoot our wounded around here. That's a, a motto I think is important as well. He didn't do anything. He didn't do shit, dude. Supposedly he he wrote some saucy message to one of the women. But I read the saucy message. It wasn't very saucy, frankly. It was quite tame, really. I mean, inappropriate, like... Hey, don't fart with me. We're we're supposed to have already have established that we're platonic or something. Maybe there's that possible angle on it, but I mean, it wasn't anything. And I think the problem was mostly about his friend Kevin, who was, what's the secret? Oh, what the thing say? Oh, I don't even fucking remember. I mean, I seriously don't remember. It was very banal. It was like, oh, like something like, hey, why don't you? get out from underneath those covers so I could see a little more or something like that. That's not something that I read and go, oh. that's something I go, are people upset about this? You know, tell them to shut the fuck up if you don't like it. I mean, whatever. He's, he's so easy to push around. That's the thing. If you're a chick, he's easy to push around. If you want to do that shit. If you don't want to do it, I'm happy to do it for you. Which is, I think, probably why I got message and message in the first place. Which is, one person didn't feel like busting chops. And then one, they were just like, will you bust chops? And they're like, well, of course I will. <laughs> like, thank you so much for inviting me to your party. That is so sweet of you. I mean, I think, you know, let me hit the piñata? You know, are you sure you don't want to hit the piano? Talking, talking with famous people. I don't know why you're so nice to me. You say, I really don't want to hit the piñata. I'd rather you do it. But that's insane. You must want to hit the piñata. You really don't. Well, fuck, I'll hit it. <laughs> 